guys, it's Rianne, and today I have a haul for you. Um, I usually do my traveling at the beginning of summer, but this year I'm traveling at the end of summer, and it has proven to be kind of a problem for me because I just keep accumulating more things for my trip, um, and I need to remember that I only have a finite amount of space in my suitcase to take these things, um, but I am absolutely loving what I have picked up, and all this stuff is really great for summer too, so I I absolutely love it, but I do need to cool it. Um, but yeah, anyway, I wanted to show you guys what I had picked up, so let's go ahead and get started. So the first things I have to show you are actually a necessity, um, because I did get in a little bit of trouble with my optometrist for not wearing sunglasses enough um, and I needed a new pair and I have bought quite a few of pairs of sunglasses from Solstice sunglasses um, so that is where I went to get my new pair I had I bought like I think three or four pairs of Ray-Bans from them before they have an online store but they also have some stores um, that are brick and mortar meaning in person um, so I decided to place an order online and the sunglasses came here really fast they have such an amazing selection of designer sunglasses um, so I went on there and I perused around and I decided upon a pair of Dior sunglasses. Inside we have the glasses in the glasses case and then also this is a little Dior glasses cleaner. The case is really cool and geometric and inside we have the sunglasses as well as the sunglasses um, authenticity certification card. And the sunglasses look like this. Oh my gosh, I'm so in love with them, you guys. They are called the Lady Dior Stud. So this is what they look like straight on, of course. And then on the side, it says Dior. And then there's like little gold studding and it is mimicking the um, quilting on the Lady Dior bag, which is on my wish list, let me tell you. Um, and so I thought these sunglasses would be so great. I really needed a new pair and I thought they would be just perfect for being in Paris. Dior is obviously a French fashion house. Um, so I thought it would be really, really fun. I absolutely love them. Like I said, they're authentic and I got them at Solstice. Um, and I will have a link to their website below and a link to these sunglasses directly if you want to check them out. But yeah, I can't, I can't recommend them enough. I've been a patron for a really long time and they're a great place to pick up authentic designer eyewear. So in a few weeks, I am heading to France. I am going to be going to Paris as well as Nice, Monaco, and Saint-Tropez. Um, I've never been to the south of France before and I really could not be more excited. I am just ecstatic, you guys. And as I was kind of like thinking and planning out my trip, I realized I was going to be spending a lot of time on the beach and in beach clubs and in the sun. And so I was like, okay, I need hats and I need bags. Um, so I went on the San Diego Hat Company website um, and I found just the perfect things. I cannot wait to show these to you. The first thing that I wanted to look at were straw hats because I needed a new straw hat really badly. Um, and this one is so perfect, you guys. I just feel like this hat is the epitome of beach chic. I love it so much. Um, I also love that it has this really great wide brim, which means that there will be a lot less sun kind of on this area. Um, which is good and also it has an SPF of 50. The other thing I really like about this hat is that the um, part where your head goes in is adjustable so you can make it tighter or looser um, based on what you need. I have kind of a small head so that was totally key for me um, and yeah I just oh I cannot wait to be wearing this like in the south of France. I mean come on. It's great. So I was really only planning on getting that hat, but when I was on the website, I saw this hat too, and I was like, ooh, I really need that hat as well. So I had to, I just had to pick this one up as well. I think this one is just so chic as well. Um, I wear a lot of black, and so when I saw this black sun hat, I kind of had to have it, and ah. Oh, I love that these hats are practical because obviously they're keeping the sun off of your face, um, but also they are so fabulous and they really are such a great way to elevate your outfits. And oh, I'm so excited, I love them so much. <laughs> I also decided to pick up some beach bags because I realized that I don't really have like a good beach bag in my life. Um, and when I saw this one, I was like, oh my goodness, 
how how have I gone this long without this bag? I mean, honestly. So it looks like this. It's incredibly spacious. You could definitely fit like five beach towels in here. Um, and then also it has like this little dedicated small pocket so you can put important things in there. But what I like about it most of all is that it is woven. So when you are putting all of your things away at the beach and you decide to go home, all of the sand that you collect up is going to fall out and you won't have to get home and like shake out your bag and try to get all of the sand out. Like it'll just naturally kind of fall out and not keep in this bag. And that is so key. Um, so I am just so excited to take this next time I go to the beach. It's incredibly substantial. Like your wet bathing suit is not gonna damage this bag. Um, and yeah, I think it's, it's just a perfect beach bag, really. This next item I am so excited about. It is incredibly chic and wonderful and I can't wait to wear it in the south of France. Um, and that would be this circular woven bag. I can't, I can't even get over it. It's so great. Um, I just, again, it's incredibly chic. Um, it is just like a regular bag on the inside, you know, but I'll be able to throw everything that I need in here, lipstick, phone, wallet, etc. cetera. Um, and then I'll be able to kind of like walk around in the south of France um, in the evening when I'm getting dinner, etc. So I am just so, so excited about this bag and I think it's gonna look really great when I style it. So since I'm going to be in the south of France for over a week, I needed to get swimsuited up. So I have a few swimsuits that I decided to get for my trip. This first swimsuit is from Vix Paula Armani and I, I'm so in love with it. So I feel like white swimsuits are always a little bit iffy for me, but because this one has so much texture and it's so thick, um, I felt really, really comfortable in it. So when I tried it on, I was like, oh my gosh, I have to have this. Because I've always wanted a white swimsuit, but I've never been able to find one that was, you know, as good as this. So um, it has this really cool sort of like texture. It's sort of like a triangle top. Um, and then this is the bottom part. And then on the back here, it has this really cute like gold hardware as well. Um, so I thought this would just be so so, so cute, especially once I get a little tan going. This next suit is from a brand I've talked about before and I absolutely love, um, and that would be Kaya Swim. I love these because they are reversible. And this one is so stinking cute. Um, so it had this is the top, it's kind of like a cream color, um, and then it has this lace detail down the front. Um, and if you were to wear it on the reversible side, um, you could have it black and lace up down the front. Um, and then it has a pair of high-waisted bottoms and they're just black on the other side, but they have this cute little piping on this side and uh, yeah, incredibly cute. And I feel very French as well. This last swimsuit is by Tori Praver and this is something that I didn't really think would be 100% sort of my style because as you can probably tell, I do a lot of black and white and neutrals. But when I tried this on, I was like, this is amazing, I have to have. Um, so it looks like this. I love that it's kind of like this vintage sort of like um, brassiere sort of shape. Um, and actually it is sort of like a cheetah print. And it also comes with these really cute bottoms with kind of like a mesh cutaway on the hips. Um, I just really love the fit of this as well. And again, I just, I can't wait to style these and be on the beach in the South of France. Like that's all I can focus on right now. And I need to like, you you know, go to work and do things, but it's really hard for me not to just focus on my trip that's coming up. So next I have a few clothing items to show you. Um, the first one I wanted to show you is this one, and this is by Aster the Label. As you can see, it is a beautiful linen dress, which is very on trend. Um, it also has these like really romantic puffy sleeves, and it's got these little ties right here. Um, it is just incredibly adorable, and I can't wait to wear this in the south of France like when I'm going to dinner. Um, I just think this will be such a perfect thing to just throw on at the end of a beach day and go and grab some food. This next dress is kind of in the same vein. It's this linen that is cream colored. Um, it has these cute little sleeves. It also has this really unique sort of like rounded square neckline. Um, it has these really cute sort of natural looking buttons going down the front. Um, and I just, again, thought this would be so cute after a day at the beach to just, you know, 
transition into and head out to a night on the town in Saint Tropez. This last clothing piece is not traditionally my style, um, but like even today, I feel like this is the perfect piece of clothing for the summer because it is this beautiful eyelet romper. Um, it is just so light and airy and fun, and I just I put it on and it was such a great fit. I thought this would be great for throwing over my bathing suit when I'm just like heading out to the beach with my friends and I'm not really sure if we're gonna like, you know, go and have cocktails or dinner later. Um, so I just thought this was a really great piece for things like that. It's just like a perfect summer piece and I actually really love it. The last few items I wanna show you are both from Aqua de Parma. And actually last year when I was in Italy, I would go into the pharmacies and smell Aqua de Parma and I loved Aqua de Parma scents. Um, but the one that I decided to go with is Cipresso di Toscana, and that means Cypress of Tuscany. I absolutely love the fragrance of this. Oh, yes. It honestly is a little bit on the masculine side, but I always kind of tend towards more masculine scents. I just really like them. So of course, because I love it, I also really love this candle, which is also Aqua de Parma, of course. And this is Luce di Colonia. Luce means light. Um, so it comes in this beautiful like packaging. And then on the inside, it is this gorgeous, gorgeous candle. This is one of those things that would be an amazing gift, especially if you're like staying with someone one over the summer or something like that, um, this would be an amazing gift to receive. Um, it smells absolutely just amazing. I have had it on my bedside table. I didn't burn it yet because I wanted to show it to you guys, but I'm really excited to start burning it because it just smells so fresh and oh my gosh, I just love everything Aqua de Parma makes. It just makes me so, so happy. <laughs> so that brings me to the end of this haul. Um, I can't at the moment think of anything else that I need for my trip, but we shall see. Um, if I do pick up anything else for my trip, you know I'll be telling you about it here. Um, and yeah, I think all this stuff is also just really great no matter where you're spending your summer, even if it's just at the pool or you know out at the park. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so, so much for watching don't forget to subscribe if you like beauty fashion and travel videos and uh, yeah don't forget to follow me on Instagram if you would like it's at Rianne star and I will talk to you very soon bye